What's going on, my boys? It's your boy, YT Dan, back at it again with a brand new video. Now, today, we're going to be getting in there with a new official reaction series, and I don't have a name for it. But basically, I need to explain to you why I'm creating this series. The Yu-Gi-Oh! community is a great community that will support its people and its players. But unfortunately, the algorithm does not support the people or its players. Content creators are making amazing content all the time, and we are missing out. The algorithm only gives you what it thinks you like and doesn't recommend anything else. I realize and understand the value of reactions now as, in a way, technically, as a YouTube channel, I am a pseudo algorithm for you. I have accumulated some content and I'm revealing it to you. And in a way, I could be your introduction to that content. Um, it only dawned on me that this is relevant and necessary because of Red Muffler Man's video and his reaction and seeing his reaction to that video and also seeing other people's reaction to that video. It not only did it encourage me to create more content like this, but also it, it really showed me how awesome content creators are making cool stuff all the time and it's just not being seen. Like 20,000 views on YouTube is kind of nothing. A million views on YouTube is kind of nothing. Like there's a lot of things that have a million views that you have not seen. So that's the point of bringing this content uh, to the forefront. Now, we got to get in there. Now, you definitely don't know this YouTube um, Dead Soldiers Incorporated. This YouTube is a classic YouTube channel. It's been around for a really long time. Um, I, maybe even longer than me, around maybe 10 years or more. But uh, this is an awesome YouTube channel. OG live action YouTube channel. Now, if you watch a lot of live action YouTube, it is uh, I mean, a live action Yu-Gi-Oh! YouTube. It is a little cringe. Don't get me wrong. It can be cringe. But this guy has, a, not only does he have the spice, but he's got the sauce. He's actually got talent for this type of stuff. He made his own cards. He even created 3D graphics for him. It's just really cool. But right now, we're going to be watching something from his previous series. It's the Revelations of the Seal of Orichalcos. This is episode 39. This guy is really cooking with this. this. I believe this was five years ago. So this was around the same time. I made Duel Links movie. I think this was five years ago. Let me double check. Yeah. Yeah, this was five years ago. So this was around the same time I made the Duel Links movie. And I mean, you, you can see how I got some inspiration. But I think this came out after the Duel Links movie. So I was inspired by whatever came before, maybe. But but I took a lot of inspiration for the Duel Links movie from this person. Um, this is just an amazing series. It's always been, like, top of my heart. I, I left comments on this specific video five years ago. And I want you guys to go leave some comments on it right now. So let's check it out right now. Dead Soldier Studios, Revelations of the Seal of the Ori Calcos, episode 39, Yu-Gi-Oh! Live Action Series. Get ready. Shout out to the Patreons. <laughs> Yes, and he was one word for an epic intro. Dramatic source productions. <laughs> yes. Yes, this intro is fire. I remember watching this over and over again. Yes, I remember watching this over and over again back in the day. He said that atmosphere. You can definitely see that he has a lot of uh, inspiration from Star Wars. I love this scene. So this is all him. But, you know, obviously he's setting it up with multiple bodies and stuff. This guy's talented. Look at this. And he's, and uh, okay, keep in mind, this is a Yu-Gi-Oh! live action anime. Who are these men? Why do they have guns? Why are Dark Duel Discs on production? So many questions need to be answered, but if you watch all 38 episodes as I did, then you would know. Nani? <laughs> Look at them 
on, getting their decks. Yes. Yes, they got a machine creating the decks. Deck distribution. Let's go. I love that deck distribution. <laughs> yes. Make sure all your decks are hyper geometric, my boy. <laughs> Next time we we not, next time we not gonna use so many blacks on blacks. It's kind of dark, but I understand why he did that. It's you know it's easier to work with when they're dark colors. That's why the big studios do it. That's why my shit dark. <laughs> if I can, the lighting is what makes things tough to uh, animate and work with. You know, if you're trying to make stuff look really cool. But this guy does a great job. I don't know if he makes these things or if he acquires these assets. I know some of the stuff is acquired, but he definitely hand makes these parts. This is he's cooking right here. Get ready. Yes. My lord, I have the catalysts you requested. Extracted straight from the depths of the Ionian Sea. Oh shit. <laughs> yes, that's the man seven in the legend right there. Seven singularities. Any one of which of these artifacts, when in the hands of a depraved human, could create a new Avistus Lord, more powerful than Zashi. Zashi! Y'all gotta check out that Zashi, my boy. The Zashi duel was crazy. Y'all gotta watch the Zashi duel. Or maybe we can watch the Zashi duel. Zashi duel was nuts. There's actually a lot of favorite duels I have. The Zashi duel was crazy. The duel with the little minion guy that was like, I forgot, I think it was Zashi's like main minion, and there was one of the core hero's friends. It could I remember that episode was amazing too. We have prepared so many the car synthesis chamber for your use, my lord. Our troops have begun to secure key locations. No shots have been fired by any official channels yet. However, there is a group of miscreants rioting in an abandoned area of New Persepolis. Mm -hmm. We have dispatched a group of clones to investigate. He's dropping that dialogue you. thick. But you know, this is like his first production, so it's not that like big a deal, you know. You just kind of got to suspend your disbelief and get deep into the story and immerse yourself. And I mean, to be real, he doesn't make it hard to immerse yourself into the story, especially in his later works. He does a great job, especially when his work is animated later on. He gets to put more um, feeling and uh, emotion into it. So his most recent content is animated, but um, production is a little slow. But, you know, it's a big work, you know. I'm sure he's got all kinds of stuff going on. He's scanning the ancient texts so he can create the ultimate card. This is my first, this is my best scene right here. This is my best scene right here. This this is it right here. He's creating the cards right here. <laughs> Negate. Yes. Do some Tyler T Y T collaboration. Double T collaboration. Let's go. <laughs> Pick me up, Tyler T. Let's cook. <laughs> oh, yeah, I like this scene too. This is a great scene. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> some dudes got guns, some dudes got dual discs. That's just such an imbalance. <laughs> this is great. Watch this. Well, Tori, nothing but a little girl. Got his big bar pants on today, huh? Huh? Well, why don't you show me where he is, huh? I'm gonna teach him a big lesson of my own. I got a stick for him. Oh, you know where this is going, huh? You know what he's gonna do with that thing. Where are you? <laughs> then he appears from the shadows. So, you well, think I'm a from your light. Card game? <laughs> yeah. Let me get you one of them old fat Valtor. Guns hurt harder than cards. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot he killed that man like. <laughs> like, I forgot he did that. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> I 
forgot he had a whole melee moment. That's crazy. <laughs> no! Perhaps we can be a bit more civilized. Yes, I love it. Maybe we can be more civilized. Pull yeah, up the yeah, dual disc. He doesn't know a thing about the streets. Yes. Dual he doesn't yeah. know about the streets. Give me that you, dual disc. Boy. I love yeah. that line. He doesn't know shit about the, the streets. The Lord has blessed this dual disc. <laughs> I like that Doesn't he has a religious he like zealot. He's got like a, a just a random thug, and then he's got like a guy who can't even speak English. He can just grunt. Uh, 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 I saw your broadcast. It is obvious your heart has been corrupted by the darkness. By the dark. I will heal it with the yes, power of love and light. I'm afraid yes. you're mistaken. This man knows how to cook, like man. Probably spent all that time writing that script. Oh yeah, totally forgot though to, even though I started this off talking about the Seal of Orichalcos, totally forgot he borrows the Seal of Orichalcos thing, and that's a whole thing, and that is a great part of the story, but the rules. again, I'm clearly out now. he's the best. <laughs> it only makes sense that I would make the first move, but like first this. I'm going to summon Orichalcos Automaton in attack mode. Negate! Some of his created cards. Damn. I end my turn. Bound you normal forward. summon, get plus two, and then they go back nothing. to the deck and then you put them in your hand. That's, that's crazy. That would be even love. crazier if he had hand traps. I like they would be like Orikako's effect Valor. <laughs> or By Orikako's sending these blossom. two monsters from my hand to the graveyard, I can perform mm. a ritual summon. Take minus Vessels three to summon Sean Shinado. You about to be dead in those streets, brother. Dark place. And purify the darkness. Purify Rise the darkness. Shinato, I love that. King of a higher plane. I end my turn. <laughs> it's he my turn now. <laughs> Why'd you do that? I, I remember I saw that years ago. I was like, what are you doing? <laughs> oh, six sand time. With his effect. I can special summon Kagemursha of the Six Samurai from my hand. Oh, he finally says something more than. <laughs> so I guess I know what Tyler thinks about now, Six Samurai players. <laughs> or Kage players. <laughs> oh, I like Saint how you did that. Summon, I like how you did that. Six Samurai. She end. She I end. Two cards and end my turn. I draw. I activate the spell card. Polymerization. This will fuse my elemental hero Burstinatrix Boy, and elemental the hero heroes. Avion together to form elemental hero Flame Wingman. Hey, yo. <laughs> elemental heroes, I see. <laughs> I also set like two that. cards elemental and hero, end my I turn. See. Finally, it's my turn. I draw. I summon Jowgen the Spiritualist, activate Moon Mirror Shield, and set four. I end my turn. Now I fuse together the three Cyber Dragons in my hand. Oh, Nani? I fusion summon Cyber and Dragon! And he can attack. Damn. He's so scared he can't even scream. I like that line too. I'm going to overkill you completely. I activate the magic card. I imagine taking on the, over the world and getting killed by a random thug, cyber and dragon in an alley. Something's not right. Wait. This guy needs to die. Cyber and dragon, attack him directly. No. Wait. Super Strident Blaze. Damn, he was standing there like, yeah, let's get it to me. You see? No problem at all. He's dust. <gasps> wow! You really got him! May he rest in peace. <laughs> Damn. <gasps> Ooh, what the hell? Oh no. It looks like you missed. Yeah! He said it! Impossible! You missed! My attack hits you head on! <laughs> yes. yeah. You However, missed. He said our line, boy. He said our line. allows me to select the battle targets of all my opponent's monsters. Yeah. As long as I control Basically, the seal of his trap card. Impossible! Ushien would have negated your trap card! 
Your CM looks quite pre <laughs> Watch this, is funny. The moment. <laughs> what did you do? That is Ori Calco Stella Vera. Your CM's effect triggered her own effect, which negated his effect. It's a tuner. This also triggered her to be special summoned to the field. Basically. Also, during the turn she's Basically, special it's to a the hand field, trap. My cards are unaffected by your card effects. It's a hand trap this that negates, isn't fair that at summons all. itself and Life has protection. This isn't fair at all. Life isn't fair. Have destroyed your teammate. They've not only cost him this duel, but they've cost him his soul. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> now at the end you understand yes. I gave you an yes. opportunity to join yes. us see he did but better job being a villain than Nocturne just saying building. just saying you no longer have a place in this world now I believe it's my turn your foolishly played limiter removal will destroy your cyber end dragon damn I activate Ori Calco Sorcery Magnus Damn. I don't think so. Xi'an, negate his spell card. Negate. As long as I control the seal of Ori Calcos, Ori Calcos Sorcery Magnus can't be negated by your card. So effects. basically, he's a branded player. This card will special summon two monsters from my deck a tuner and a non tuner. Mm -hmm. And it will split their souls three ways. Splitting Split souls? The soul. Blasphemy! I summon Ori Calcos <laughs> Wandering Spirit and Ori Calcos Militus. Wandering Spirit's effect will allow me to summon another Stellavarum from my deck. Damn. Another hand now, trap Ori monster Calcos from the deck. Busted. Soul rending. Soul rending. Rise, coils of darkness. Invade, constrict, and destroy. Choke away all hope. Fusion summon. Or a Calcos Athletos. Yeah, this is hot. Oh yeah, this is hot. Undying dark rage. Crush it all in a frenzy. Turn it all to dust. Synchro summon. Or a Calcos Magna Draco. Yes. I love it. Unparalleled. Such good work. Rend Such away good work. All dignity. It's amazing. All to your might. Exceed summon. Yeah, it gives me the chill still. Grand Opus Dragon. <laughs> when these three creatures are summoned, I can add these to my hand. But I won't be needing them. For what you. is this? <laughs> Fusion? Synchro? And Exes? What's XYZ? <laughs> I've never seen it before. <laughs> you won't be here long enough to contemplate it. No! No! Mercy! Please have mercy! I'll, I'll, join you. You. I'll do anything! <laughs> you will find a higher purpose once your soul yeah. is taken to serve me in the Orichalcos. Orichalcos Magna Draco. Attack Shinato, king of a higher plane. Cook time. I like that attack. I thought that was pretty good. When Magna Draco destroys a monster, it can attack again. Destroy Xi'an. With this cellar on the field, I can't use my trap cards. Uh, ah! I guess he had that no, bounce. Watch his human bleeds. No! <laughs> <laughs> Take the rest of his pathetic life. Yes. No! <laughs> yes. He did such a good and job. Grand Especially Opus this Dragon. episode. Finish them off. Yes. Oh, I mean, real talk. No! Like, I don't know what As anyone might moment, say about his production, the world but real talk, the graphics that he's working with right now is like from the first Power Rangers movie in the 90s, and he's doing this on his own. That's pretty dope, man. That's pretty dope. On okay. top of acting and every writing the script and everything else, absolutely amazing production, man. So y'all go on over, check out the boy, 
check out Revelations of the Seal or Ikalkos. This is his old first classic series. It goes back a really long time, many, many episodes. But the 39, I believe, is um, his most uh, succinct work. Like, he put a lot of uh, content together for this 39. And then after the 39 is his animated series that I'm currently watching, which is the live animated series. So you got to check it out, man. Ain't nobody making a production, a Yu-Gi-Oh! Passion project, project like um tyler t man nobody's doing it like your boy uh <laughs> nobody's doing it like the revelation of the tiller and calcos hey, this never it was never done like this before and then i think the only and then everyone else is like pale imitations so my boy there's not a lot of good um live action Yu Gi Oh's out there but this is definitely one of them man this is one of them this is a classic it's absolutely from the uh just just straight from the heart man yeah, like you know passion when you see it, man. You know passion when you see it. So I absolutely loved it. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this one. Um and catch me in the next reaction video, my boys. And as always, this is your boy YT Dan signing out.